What's up? Up is a two-letter word that indicates direction. Oh my word, that's funny! <laughs> I'm a funny guy! Back to our stupid Rex video, some Corbin. Rick. And you can follow us on Instagram, Instagram and Twitter, Twitter for more juicy, juicy content. content. And you can go to us on Patreon juicy. and follow our official Twitter account. And today, uh, we are reacting to a little interview. It's uh, 10 minutes long. Uh, but this is a little <laughs> clip. I think uh, sh this girl, similar to the Bollywood Roundtable, she does her own kind of thing. Got it's it. Not a, uh, we're not watching the whole thing, so it's not going to be an hour and a half long. This is a 10 minute clip. But this is on what uh, South. Indian actors uh, think of the Hindiest, Hindi cinema. Hmm. Uh, so that's okay. interesting. That's very interesting. Interesting topic uh, and what they think. But I think it, this has a bunch of people in it, not just South Indian actors. I think Topeka and um, Kajgana are in here as well. I could be totally okay. wrong, but uh, this is full of just a bunch of actors. Uh, so let's. This get... should be interesting. Yeah. Your film Hit the bell icon so you never miss an update. You know, post Bahubali, I think it's fair to say that regional is the new national. Um, th this whole idea of, of we are this and you are that, BJ. I think is just over and thank God for that. Um, uh, part of the yeah. already oh, yeah. a Hindi film. <coughs> Vijay, you're working with Amir in Lal Singh Chagra. Vijay, you're being wooed by the everybody Pika. from Ranveer. Karan Ranveer. Johar down. What are your biggest concerns about Hindi cinema? What is your fear or what kind of things unsettling about the space? My I'm looking at them because you've already done it. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> My fear is language is the first. Yeah. Um, then, fear is what? Language. Language. <clears throat> language and then uh, I don't know much about this culture and I don't watch much in the films. So, it's the same, sir. And he's working with Ahmed, Lal Singh Chanda. No, no, no. <laughs> no but, but I believe that language anybody can learn. Easily they can learn, but the culture is very important. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Through the culture only we can connect the audience. So <laughs> that's true. So more than a language, because language so say if you go to Saudi, if you work for six months, we could learn uh, uh, Arabic also. So language is not a big barrier, but I should learn the language. But main thing is I should know the culture properly. Yeah. Then only culture, what do you mean so like nuances the 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 not the body yeah. language. The, the, you may go through a different way and we may think of a different way. Yeah, I agree. It's Maybe different. in a family where it's important. Uh, see, uh, friendship or uh, the way yes. you can look. Great point. Uh, financial yeah. status or the friendship. Not in so it, wrong. It can be we ran into that. City. Mm -hmm. uh, every city has an energy and every state has an energy. Right. Mm -hmm. And uh, they maintain themselves in a different way. So, so I should know about that thing also. If, because only I can understand the character and then I can play uh, the way I know the people uh, in my state. Uh, the, my, my circle. So so I can connect with South India. Yeah. Maybe Tamil or Telugu, Malay, I can easily connect with them because we are very close culture, similar cultures. But when I come to Hindi, that I should know the culture most. Language is not the biggest bell because we can, I, I was working in Dubai for three years. I, I used to speak Hindi fluently. Now it's been 16 years, so I, I don't have a touch with it. So, huh. But still, I can understand Hindi. But language is not the biggest problem. And the, the main thing is the culture. We should know the culture. Then only we, we can connect with the audience. Wherever uh, I go, it's a great point. Uh, so in South India, wherever I go, uh, people they connect with me, mm -hmm. they feel. And then if you really, if you really know the culture, if you really care for the people, if you know the society well, <coughs> and through your art form you can touch everybody. That's what I mean. If you have a True. pure, uh, the pure love for the people, yeah. And then uh, innocence you have, and the purity you have means whatever you do. And if you can just move the cup from here to there, <laughs> you can connect. Yeah. That's what I mean. The innocence is very important. Yeah, so for the crowd. then uh, in every character there is an uh, there is a there is a uh, nuances there that you can connect with audience whether it be a good guy or bad guy that you can connect. Hmm. That's what I believe. Vijay, what do you know? Teacher told prophet. He said, I think he he said it perfectly. I think these are the the first thing is of course language, but uh, coming from Hyderabad, there's a lot more Hindi and it's. Mm -hmm. uh, you hear it a lot, you speak it a lot, but you speak a different dialect called Deccani. Mm -hmm. uh, so that way I, I know I can figure that out, but definitely uh, to be born in a place, to be brought up there, to know the social, how it, like I can't play a Delhi, Delhi wala for example, 
I don't even know how to say Delhi or Delhi or what. <laughs> so, uh, Delhi. So I can I can never do that. So definitely the kind of cinema if I do Hindi will be restricted to some kind of neutral cinema that works across cities. It's not very rooted culturally and uh, uh, it's not very rooted culturally. It needs to be some neutral kind of film. That's one and uh, the traffic and rains is also very bothersome. <laughs> That's Bombay. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> when I did the uh, movie with Tanuja, I still struggled. I still had the South Indian accent coming, the nasal twang, but I do have a habit of mimicking. Like if I spend half an hour with you, I'll, I'll probably start laughing like you. My mom used to find out that he's like, same thing. Same thing. Yeah. Same thing. I think like, that's probably true with that most that actors. Happens. It's an actor same thing. thing. Yeah. Same thing. <laughs> I always start talking in the person that I was spending time. Exactly. Happens, happens, happens. That's amazing. Fun. That's fun. Yeah, that's fun. Yeah. Talking about. Yeah. But the thing is, that's great for the job. But in real life, right. you're almost like come come across the same. Like it because I actually spent time with an American for a while and all that. So <laughs> that, language is great. I, I I love learning languages. But I also done Kannada films. I've done uh, Tamil films. In the first Tamil film, I used to make the director speak to me in Tamil only. So that I start mimicking him. It's like a little baby learning to walk. Like uh, you'll keep kind of emulating what the other person is doing, but you make mistakes. But I think language is the thought in which a character thinks. Now, yeah, I can't think in Malayalam and then perform in Telugu yeah. or Kannada. Mm, so it, learning the language. So spot boys and everyone have great help. So just to ask for water, I make the effort to learn the language bare minimum, and I do beg to dub. I mean, please make me dub. And if I do a bad job, please save the character for me and like you know find the right person. So otherwise, it gets really fucked up. Mm. But I, I would love to use my voice. So language is a great oh, thing. Yeah. But Bombay, me, I have one concern is that there is a lot of exposure of the actor, um, a lot more than South India. Mm. Like uh, I just pass. Like perhaps, and mm. but also there is a reason for it. Genius. I feel like there is a certain culture of that here, which overwhelms me. Like I, I, I if I walk around in Kerala, um, also I have the resting bitch face, so like people don't really come to me. But, <laughs> uh, but uh, and also the feminist and the uh, uh, activism part of it, are yeah, this is self But <laughs> so I feel like um, here, if somebody does that, I freeze. Like because in 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 front of the camera or in on a film set, I am completely naked. Like I can be whatever, but in front of other people, I'm like, but I'm not a, I'm not yours. Mm. Our beach me contract hai. That's the film. Mm. That's our like, you know give and take. So that's kind of scary to be very honest. Mm. It's not regarding the craft. The craft I felt like I just dive in. But the other thing is a little scary. So I can feel. <laughs> okay, if you guys could take advice. On process, craft, acting, fame, from one actor in Indian cinema, alive or dead, Big who would it be? Ayush. I think I know stars. Ah ha ha. Because you are the Ayush. Come on, Ayush. Don't say that. Ayush, Manasim. It's a tough question. No, no. Think about it. Let's think about it. Vijay, for you? Ah, Sivaji Ganesh. So not the best actor. Yes. He's one of the best actor. He could do any kind of role, and then. Uh, Kamal sir, mm. he's brilliant. He's he said Kamal. An actor, he's very brilliant. And I think he said Kamal. Also. I like Mohan also very much. Mm. He's I don't know how he's performing. He just played very very easy. I also like to spend some time with him. Yeah. <laughs> 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 so, I think that is Kamal. Thanks, it is. I think I think so. No, there. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> but uh, and then of course, uh, hope you know Injas. Injas yeah. is one of very brilliant actor. His his descriptions is very beautiful descriptions, and uh, all his movies, his songs are very good. Yeah. He is very brilliant uh, descriptions, and uh, uh, he do it on the meter. Seems very brilliant. So, so all of them. Uh, and for you, Vijay, <laughs> <laughs> as in without shame, like a lot of people on this table have had massive crushes, <laughs> like been in love with some of them. Well, tell yeah. us. Yeah, like these two have used. To... <laughs> she got married, but uh, and I used to love that, but she's getting married. <laughs> so. <laughs> and I, by the way, this exhibition. <laughs> <laughs> I made that up. I made that up. Okay. <laughs> okay. <laughs>
and uh, I've, I've loved I've loved some of Manoj sir's performance that I've seen. I've watched some of his early films. Uh, Ranveer, some work like when I watched Gully Boy, I couldn't sleep. Really? Like there are some films when I watch, I can't sleep for three nights because I'm like, what am I doing with my life? Whoa. I think. So, uh, <laughs> but uh, I've always, uh, I've really liked Ranbir and uh, I've, I also really like my sleep. He's dating Ranbir. But these two, uh, I don't want to talk to them and ask them yeah. that process because uh, yeah, auto actors push it a lot, like they'll give you some. <laughs> uh, you have to, I think you have to be that boy. Or right. something. You need to be on set throughout the day, throughout the film, because I don't even know, I don't even think actors are aware of what all they do completely. I think we do a lot of things subtly that we cannot articulate. Yeah. Uh, mm -hmm. So you need to be there, be there for uh, for an entire process of a film from pre-production to post-production. Yes. Exactly how they're going about things and do, but uh, yeah. So I think uh, Ranbir, uh, because. Him also, I started watching him before I never knew I'd be an actor when I watched him. The rest I started watching once I kind of became an actor. Like so a, that was a pure love. Yeah, now it's like a colleague type feel. But then it's like pure, then it's like you. Cut off before you got to... I wanted to know, I wanted to hear from Ranveer and Alia. Well, it's an entire, it's yeah. like an hour long thing, just like the round table one. Yeah. Um, that was really interesting though. Because we obviously we know now that India's India is full of what? How many language industries? A lot. But there's seven That's primary ones, but there's way more than that. that. You know, it, you know it's a different language, but you don't like in America. We don't have to think about that when you go to a different state. No, you don't have to think about oh, I don't know the language you or just, the cultural yeah. difference being so strong. Yeah, we have different cultures in America, but they're not as I think di like divergent. Like, Extremely divergent, extremely uh, divergent as as others. Some are. I mean, there's a trailer park and all that kind of stuff. So there are some yeah, extremes, but, but uh, there's. It's not like when you just go to a different state, like he was saying. But he's totally correct. He's like, you have to learn the language. Yeah, it's even deeper than say in England, where you go to various places around England and the accents just dr drastically change, mm -hmm. and and also the cultures change. But there's a common through line there. It's similar to the United States. You get different accents in Los Angeles than you do in Louisiana, than you do up in Minnesota, than you do over in Brooklyn. Yeah. And the the but the cultural shifts aren't so strong. Yeah. India has not only the language changes, dialect changes within the languages, and then cultural references that are completely different. Even some of the comments, like for example, my shock with and the unbelievability for me of the crying in Super Deluxe. Lots of messages from Super Baby saying, from Stupid Baby saying, this is how they cry. This is not an exaggeration. Mm -hmm. And the cultural thing, it's for example, in Natsumrat, where we were like, what's the big deal? Well, for Marathi, that, the culture there, that's a big deal. Mm -hmm. And I thought it was extraordinarily intelligent. And the comment he had, as well as it's making me realize more and more, we knew this, one of the reasons that Americans don't pay attention to Indian cinema is because Americans don't pay attention to anything that's not American. Mm -hmm. So <clears throat> to jump into another culture, to take your hat off of what you live in here in America and say, I, would, I, I don't just want to watch another film because we've, we've even talked about when we recommend films, there's certain films we won't recommend because they need to know the culture first. Mm -hmm. Don't don't watch Devdas. Don't watch Lagan mm -hmm. before you see English of English or you see Gully Boy because mm -hmm. you're gonna get lost. Yeah. And I we're having the same thing happen when we're going into South Indian film. Mm -hmm. uh, film I'm sure we could see something now and in five years see it and go, wow, I totally didn't appreciate it five years ago because I knew nothing mm -hmm. about South India or whether or a Bengali film. Yeah, it was it was interesting though that his first concern is language when. That's like if I was to act in an Indian film, that's obviously my first concern mm -hmm. is the language. the language. But obviously I'm not surrounded by Hindi all the time. Right. I feel like uh, people in India are, regardless of the state you're in, you're more accessible to Hindi than I am here in America. Correct. Um, obviously. But uh, you, if you're in a southern state and then you go all the way up to the uh, northern state that speaks Hindi, I, I, it's probably a whole different world. 
right. basically. That's something I just didn't compute with, but that's, he, he's totally right. You have to, to do those things, you have to get the language down mm -hmm. because you don't want to be thinking uh, about the language when yeah. you're acting. She said that as well, and that was a really good point. I would want to get to the point where I'm not, like this happened, I remember when I was learning Spanish, which I'm not fluent in yet, but I got to a place where I actually could think in Spanish, which which is a huge jump and is important. If you were portraying, if I was doing something in Hindi, I would want to get the Hindi so embedded in me that I wasn't even having to think about the words anymore. Well, that's one of the reasons Header took so long, mm -hmm. is because that's how I, I, normally when I can learn a script, it's it's really fast. It doesn't take me long. No, uh, it's it's cool. It's quite simple if it's in my language, mm -hmm. <laughs> because I, I I have reference points to you know uh, once this word is said, I know what's coming next. Yep. Blah blah blah. But that's how you want it. So you want it to come out like a thought, right? Like it's your thought. And so that's why it took so long because like I might have been able to say it, but it wasn't like. I was, right. I was it wasn't thinking stream about it. of consciousness. I was thinking about it, and I, exactly. didn't, I didn't want that because that ruins the performance if you're thinking about what you're saying. Right. It looks like you're thinking about what you're saying when you're, you're supposed, especially the scene is he's just spitting off the top of his head, saying yeah. it's all because he's kind of going mental a little bit. Uh, so it was really interesting to hear that they, in, in the same country that there's that many differences. It shows you how diverse yeah. that country really is. Yeah, it's insane. I would, I would also like to hear the rest of that entire. Interview. And, and it also helps me understand a little bit better why so many in, say, Tamil or Telugu or Marathi um, are Canada, which I always mispronounce, um, want so desperately for people to appreciate their filmmaking and are quote unquote ignored. Mm -hmm. Because it isn't just an appreciation of the filmmaking, you have to get into the culture somewhat to appreciate what's being told. Uh, and that's a big leap, apparently, even for Indians mm -hmm. to do that, let alone people in the Western world. And it's one of the reasons why Americans have just generalized Indian film as Bollywood. Because I think the Hindi Bollywood film is the closest culturally to American of anything coming out of India. So it's the farthest leap for people to have to connect. And that's why it's gotten global recognition. And it's oftentimes not because the artists. <coughs> There's a lot of films we've seen that came out of Bollywood that are poo. Mm -hmm. uh, but... It's that cultural jump uh, that's that's big, but it shouldn't be an excuse to not appreciate the film. Yeah, yeah. But that was great. Great. I, I really stuff. enjoyed that. I'd like to see uh, more of that interview. <laughs> it's like I would too. Yeah. Uh, that, uh, huh? We'll get back to Corbin when his brain starts working like, again. Uh, Are you caffeinated? Wow. <laughs>